Hello. As we head towards the end of 2023, I wanted to reflect on the year and on some of our key achievements within BSI's Regulatory Services Organization. The medical devices regulatory landscape continues to be impacted by political factors. In March, the European Union extended the MDR transition timelines for manufacturers with an extension up to 2028 for certain types of devices. This has given manufacturers and notified bodies welcome breathing space and has allowed BSI to accept new customers. Whilst we welcome the extension, I would urge clients who intend to transition their directive certificates to regulation certificates not to delay their transition plans, including their technical documentation submission to ensure continuous supply of medical devices to the relevant markets. From a UK perspective, in June, the government formally extended the acceptance of the majority of CE-marked medical devices being placed on the market to 2030. Alongside this, they announced plans to bring forward proposals in 2024 that would see the UK regulatory system draw on approvals by other trusted international regulators. We await further proposals with interest and continue to actively support the UK government as they develop their plans. Our continued investment in operational and technical expertise has put us in a strong position to enable our clients to manage this transition successfully. This has also allowed us to extend our client base driving strong growth and demonstrating our commitment to our critical role in the EU regulatory system, ensuring the continued supply of critical medical technology to patients. For the BSI medical devices team, Midyear was a real highlight. We were incredibly pleased to have issued our 1,000th MDR certificate. We have continued to innovate in our own business, investing in tools and technology to enhance client-centricity through improving our service offerings. These investments drive efficiency, predictability, and support BSI's and our client sustainability agenda by reducing our carbon footprint. A key example of this is our investment in hybrid auditing, where we were the first notified body to introduce this as a widely used approach. Since June this year, our AI team has been working in reviewing AI-enabled devices against the state of the art. To achieve this, we have partnered with Citadel AI, a provider of AI testing and algorithmic auditing software. Through these tools, supported by in-depth technical analysis, BSI can measure AI compliance against the latest standards, including fairness, bias, and robustness testing. They can also automatically generate comprehensive analysis and reporting to support the assessment process. The partnership is designed to ensure that AI is used ethically, safely, and responsibly in industries that pose risks to humans. Citadel's and BSI's expertise reassures users that the cutting-edge technology increasingly being integrated into potentially high-risk innovations aligns with best practice and prepares them for the forthcoming EU regulations on AI. We are proud to be at the forefront of shaping trust in AI. BSI has had significant involvement in the generation of ISO 42001, which defines the characteristics that should be embedded in AI management systems. Due to be released in the latter half of 2024, we will support our clients with this assessment. We are a purpose-led business and our people are at the heart of what we do. This year, we have invested heavily in our RS organization, hiring over 300 new talented colleagues, bringing our team to over 1,200 people. 
Like many organizations, we are fully committed to accelerating our progress towards a better society and a more sustainable world. For BSI, achieving net zero is critical to reducing global warming and while our journey has already started, we shall continue to challenge ourselves to think innovatively, utilize technology and operate in a sustainably conscious manner. I want to say a huge heartfelt thank you to our clients, industry partners, stakeholders and colleagues for your continued support and commitment. I'm already looking forward to 2024 and the exciting road ahead. Thank you.